Good morning. Today we are going to create a supplier using SOAP API. Okay. For that, to create a supplier using SOAP API, first you will search for in Google. So, so SOAP means uh, simple object access protocol. Okay. So, so we will we will search for SOAP services for procurement in Google. Okay. So, we will get web service so web services so here we have so many things are there we have to go to supplier So then we have to copy this. Double still fed. Go to the with this. Okay, so we have to copy this WSL file, and you have to replace with your server. Our address. Okay. This is the we copy the file here. Then we have to up to server name is server name is we have to copy up to, up to this point. Okay. I copied it. I already copied it. You have to replace service, uh, server, service name, server name with the URL. Okay. So you have, then you have to you have to download the SOAP API from the Google. I already installed SOAP API. Okay. Then have to go to new soap palette. Supply and coding so supply creation. So now I am replacing in the initial WSTL file. So click on Okay. So once it's created, we have to replace create uh, copy this. We have to create this uh, file, XML file. On your own, it will be available in the internet also. So I created supplier. Go to request. Then okay. 
merangkul ini tuh dan pasted oke after that we have to go to authentication you have to go to authentication Okay, then you have to go to authentication. Now go to add new and type basic. You have to do your authenticate. So your user ID and password. Okay, then. Okay, I'm putting XYZ in LNC, LNC, then okay, at up. password so once is the uh, entire your password is going to password to be in here so we have to Click on this, then okay, then so to click on this. On one, what do I do? We'll close this all this. Yes. Number one. Our says. Then go to. Then go to and then okay, it's created. Okay. So then what we'll do? We'll go to suppliers. Then it's for what it's created. It 
is created or not agency is created because it's prospective supplier so we have to convert into we have to convert this then go to promote to spend authorized okay we can't create surprise sets because of those values permit no no import so is it? It will, it will send a message. Because it still is in a pending state. To the pro okay so the process is for search for a soap service for the payment and copy that uh, HTML file here replace uh, server name with your uh, url to server and go to create a new project new soap project and replace with the uh, replaced file and automatically create so create your own xml file in the request one and go to authorization you also know what's up or you write in password and click on this green button it will create you supply the Automatic create a supplier in the our base tables. Okay, we can see the can pick the supplier from the many suppliers. If you want to promote the prospect to customers, click on this and send authorized request. Okay, it automatically create the supplier. If you have any role, please bring me on uh, YouTube so that I can replay back on the YouTube. Okay.